Hello and welcome back to Outer Worlds. We are heading toward Cascadia. I've never been there before. Secret lab access. So, well, we gotta just uh, stick to the road apparently, and we're gonna be fine. Uh, fine after we kill some marauders apparently. I'll just stay here, guys. Don't die. Pretty strong. Maybe the, these are not the best weapons for my companions. But if they, they are definitely not the best weapons. But look at that. She's missing quite a bit. Because it's not, not really an ideal weapon. I should just... Give them some assault rifles, I think. I will see. Nyoka... I can give Parvati an assault rifle and see if she likes it. Or maybe she can have both. Can I give her both? No. I've got a ranged and melee slot. The minigun is better. Uh, of course. If uh, you can actually hit the enemies. Sneak light mask. That's actually better than what I'm using. So, we're... Currently using the lockpick 5 mask, but if you can... No, no, sneak? Oh, never mind that. That's stealth. I'm a little bit uh, mistaking stealth and sneak, but no, uh, sneak is crap. So many enemies. On my way. Let's come. We don't have to be super tricky here. Die, robot. Oh. That looks like he was uh, having a bad time. Uh, that's it. Cascadia, here we come. I wouldn't mind just running into some regular people on the road, but I, I guess it's not really a good idea to travel. But the marauders just don't get killed. They're, they're fine. Oh fuck. Scrap mechanical. Assault Rifle Ultra, this can be handy if we commit to that. For the entire team. I'm sure, some good stuff. My only job is to loot. Companions do the killing. Ooh, Rizos. Really? Okay, that's not exactly how I want to go about this. Um, so I assume... Oh. I would need 100 lockpick to get in there. Oh, there's a sneaky approach. Well, not... Not super sneaky, but not just uh, walking in and shooting up the place uh, level.
Mark II pistol. This could be fine with just, uh, like, you coming in, sneaking around, try to be smart. Oh, vending machine discovered. It's a Rizzo's. Self-service, uh, self-serve snack system. Oh, 1,300. Uh, that's not that good. Elite Troop Armor Gold, level 19. It's, it's okay. But I kind of have something like that. Uh, I have enough uh, space now. Yeah, Elite Troop Armor Gold is better. Um, super Scope. Tech Skills. I only need one of that. It's not going to be on my main armor. I only just put it on a tech armor and that's it. Okay. I don't need that. Oh my god! Resident! You're just chilling here? Wait. Law help me. Help us all. I saw one. Frotting at the mouth, barely able to string a word or two together, walking at me as if to devour me whole. Zura was right. There are monsters here. We need to get out if we want to live. Zora is uh, uh, the second in command for the Iconoc class. Cecile, you aren't insane. They were people once. I don't know what they are now. Again, Zora and Cecile. Uh, I'm not sure, but it might. She might be the second in command for Sanjar in the city. Cecile, these crazy assholes don't know how to use a keypad. I took one from my clinic office and installed it on the bridge. Uh, maybe not. Okay. Taking the box between your legs. What? Closed? No way! Uh, this is the closest I can I can bring the minimap. Bottling plant with a big neon sign. Really? These people kind of went insane. But why? Purple berry lunch? What? What is that? Plasma? And ray damage. But, but low level! Jump down. Outside, and we run, run outside for sure. No, we have to go in. Oh shit! They closed the door too. What? Incoming. Attack! Attack! Don't mess with us. 
Assault Rifle Ultra. Fine. A pulse hammer. Why would you use a pulse hammer? Heading back. Especially in this uh, land with wildlife. Wildlife should be like super easy to take care of. Maybe not super easy, but it shouldn't be that hard. You got guns. And that's it. If you need speed, you can grab a car, I guess, and start shooting wildlife off the car and uh, and or, or just use the walls that worked uh, in medieval times. Supervisor override. Uh, let's go with the password. Begin transaction. Did you get the customer by saying, Welcome to Resource Feed Shop. We've got your heart. We got your candy handy. How can I sweeten your day? Uh, yeah. Have you offered a customer a slap? Sales of lemon slap are down. Remind our customers how refreshing a good slap is. Thirsty friend? Nothing beats a zesty slap. Yep. Begin transaction. Yes. No. Reminder, all employees must meet their weekly product recommendation quota. Records indicate that you have not met recommended product in 3,689 days. Your file has been flagged for performance review. Transaction cancelled. view current inventory and there's nothing in stock so it's kind of pointless where are we going enter the secret lab in cascadia right but we're also here for uh pavetti's uh some kind of uh, candy maybe uh, there's one left Sure. I don't think there was a peaceful solution here. <laughs> like, they were called marauders. This is the only way. So we can use the lift. And what about companion quest? Uh, find sweetheart cakes. Oh, that's somewhere else. This place is not as huge as it might seem. Oh, I didn't go in here. No, no I did. Oh, come on. Sweetheart cake, that's it. Aren't those cakes just about the cutest little things you ever seen? <sighs> yeah, but they're also 10 years old. If we can trust the computer over there. Give Parvati the food. Uh, enjoy. The dust bat casserole Mr. Raymond made smells incredible. Oh, I kind of want to take a little taste. But I'm going to be strong. Now look how cute these cakes from Cascadia are. Someone even traced little hearts in them. Oh, I guess that settles dinner. Thanks for hauling me all over creation, Captain. Yeah, that's that was a little too much for your casual let my girlfriend pop by later dinner. We got uh, sweets uh, that was obviously made by a dead guy, and everybody's dead here. 
And you trust that those sweets quite a bit with all these marauders around here. Uh, I don't know. Maybe they are not as tasty right now. Or at least uh, uh, 10 years late. <laughs> not, not the freshest. That casserole was overpriced as shit. So I don't know. Maybe that, that guy is... Uh, I don't know. Maybe that's going to be a good casserole. Could be. But we're definitely not getting uh, seconds with that one. It was just so overpriced. We would go broke. We make 2,000 uh, bits on the mission and get a casserole. No way. You're welcome. Uh, shouldn't you get ready for June right now? Right now? I hope we got enough that everyone can get a taste. Ah, that's for her. Her call. You're welcome. Shouldn't you get ready for June right now? Well, I was gonna, but then it hit me. I got this nice meal all planned out with music, and I got that soap to scrub up with, but I don't got nothing nice to wear, Captain. Oh my god. Just be naked. Oh, okay, I'm, okay I'll, I'll excuse myself. Do you have anything in particular in mind? Do you really need to do all this? Or are you putting off the dates? That sounds like it. If I was more perceptive, I, that's what I would say. You have anything particular in mind? You know, what? we're just gonna keep doing this until you run out of excuses. But this is kind of like driving up your expectations, and that's no good. I don't have a head for fashion, and I can't really picture myself in something clean and pretty. There's this place I heard of in Byzantium, Jollikers Haberdashery. I bet I could find something nigh on perfect at a place like that. What? You know we can't get into Byzantium, right? Not today, no, but maybe someday. Oh, what? I know this is all a little crazy, Captain, but I think it's gotta be this place. I saw the lady who runs it on Aetherwave, and well, she made everybody she dressed feel better. That Confident. was an ad. Confident. You're really putting off this date. I'm not saying we're not gonna pick up clothes eventually. Ah, I wish I was more perceptive. Alright, this is what I would... Yeah, I would like a more perceptive character. Alright, we'll swing by when we can. Thanks, Captain. I know I've been asking a lot. But you help me out every time. You're the best. Alright. Maybe someday. Like, that was not very uh, specific. Well, not. <laughs> what, what do you want to have this date? Parvati? Like, hey, Captain. <laughs> I would like my girlfriend to come over. I said, like, hey, sure. What? We gotta hurry up. Secret uh, lab and all that. I mean, I don't mind it. If you're gonna get there, might as well buy something, right? Hello? Anybody here? Spectrum vodka, a glass for every class. Right. How big is this place? Oh my god. Where even am I? Nowhere, apparently. Oh. I, I, I run the maxi lockpicker. The tire. And even this was barely good enough to get in. Signal Ada to land on the Cascadia pad. Search, fuel controls. <clears throat> you will not see me, but I will be close. Continue your research, Doctor. Report to me when you have achieved the mission and state. 
I understand we are bound for a secondary lab. Will you be supervising our research this time, or will be will it be the standard work from your shadows routine? Thank you for your optimism, Lor. What we are doing isn't easy under the best circumstances, much less with the board cutting corners. I can promise you that our research will lead to a better Halcyon, even if we have to pay a terrible cost getting there. That's just crap. Uh, you have your orders, uh, Doctor. Your project is too important, too sensitive to allow any hint of it to reach the public. With all respect, I urge you to reconsider your decision to classify our research results on the na native fauna of Terra 1. I assure you that we will diligently redact any references to our project or its purpose from any papers we release. We have made several discoveries about how the terraforming process affected the nuclein of the Raptodon and Manti families, at the very least allow us to inform our fellow board researchers that these creatures will perish when O2 concentrations are reduced to 19.5%, a level within human tolerance. That's really good. This is not about fame or prestige, this is about potentially saving lives, please. Very good stuff. Good job, Ada. Oh, it's not gonna attack me. I don't know where I am. Ritos. Proximity alert. Biology human. Protocol kill all plants. Suspended. Present your Rizzo identification credentials or prepare to be downsized. Downsized. Disengage security protocols. I'm not a threat. Attempting to disengage security protocols without proper authorization is a fireable offense. Priming weapons. I'm an authorized Rizzo employee. Password Antediluvian. Executive level password accepted as identification according to employee ID protocol A 3501. Welcome back, Doctor. Be advised. Mantasaur threat level is Petrifying Purple Berry. What? Please use caution. Mantasaur wounds. Are not covered under Rizzo's health policy. Have a productive day. Thanks for that. What? Oh, more vending machines, but I don't even show up on the map. Yeah, we obviously can't go that way. Oh, there you go. Still some left. Traps everywhere. Fuck. Yeah, I'm permanently concussed now until I sleep. Fucked up. Hi, these uh, mantis. Okay, so apparently these were locked in here for 10 years. How? How are they not dead? Here we 
go. I managed to alert something. Okay, 100. Oh. What? That's all robots will be friendly. No such luck. Everyone all right? Is my gun broken? It's a little broken. I still can't see myself on the map. Maybe we should go back, just to be more thorough. That's right, don't mess with us. By the way, it's very convenient that uh, both threats would uh, perish uh, between uh, below 19.5% oxygen. It's a lot, but it's not completely unrealistic considering that these two beasts although very uh, different uh, evolved on the same planet nice work captain although I'm not exactly a um, an expert <laughs> align fueling system initiate transfer of alta vitae gas Arrow, this terminal does not have administrative permission required to transfer Alta Vitae gas. Access is restricted to Executive Research Focus Group terminal located in R&D labs. Okay, fine. The is making me a mite nervous. But the gas is here. Not any of the bugs, but we are pretty good. <laughs> Manti Queen. Standard troop armor, it's garbage. Let's see what we have here. Research notes, uh, tissue compatibility, acceptance losses. Chief concern is rejection of the tissue. The problem as classical as limb transplantation though, obviously on a cellular level. The scale of the problem though, even with Alta Vitae bolstering our efforts, an achievement of such proportion has never been attempted or even considered. How do we define a tolerance failure rate when the losses could swell to affect millions? Even 1% is unthinkable. dead simple shrine okay where's the console that I'm looking for 
I'm providing new clothes? I don't think so. Uh, we are doing something a little bit more important. Speak with Phineas. Okay. Siphon the gas. That's kind of what I'm trying to do. Over there. Romantic Queen is a little tougher. Oh my god. Took damage. So I and Parvati got hit for like 2,000. Bad to keep serious business. here oh this is more like it so scientists mind control ray special gun on the special weapon So this guy died, obviously. He was hiding. And then like he just couldn't escape. Or maybe he was wounded, but then hid, then no! died there. What? Really? So, imagine playing on hardcore difficulty, uh, the game on hardcore, and you lose two companions this way, you know? Or even playing on uh, Supernova without a quick save. How cheated you would feel? Even like this is kind of bullshit. That's why I had to. I had to. It's just total bullshit. It's not, not super well done. I, I, I kind of appreciate it as an option. And I think Super Nova that does have good points. And that's why I'm using it. But uh, sure. not saving is not one of them. Also, before Monarch, I, I didn't really feel like uh, I, I needed to fast travel. But on, on Monarch, I felt like, you know, fast travel is kind of handy. That, but that's not why I decided for the mod. I didn't put in two mods, I only put in the the save mod that actually came with fast travel. But I ultimately ended up using fast travel. Good job, girls. Heading back. Don't try the jumping puzzle. It's not very difficult, but apparently it's more difficult for you to. Let me take a look, see. Okay. I'm thinking if I patch this into our fuel cell network, we can use the empty tanks to hold this Ulta Wada Biddle stuff. Just gotta compensate for the pressure difference. We burn liquid reaction mass, not gas. And the cells are distributed all through the hull, so I gotta isolate the empties. Engineering 16? That looks right. You remembered the sticky valve on number 16? Of course I did, Captain. Just gave it a little jiggle. We're gonna get rich. There we are. Good as pretty and twice as new. Nice work. Oh, thanks to my moral support, you're welcome. Well, 
I knew I paid you for something. No, no, no. Nice work. Well, let's go with that. Oh, I just... just did my thing. You know. I'm impressed. I would have just tried to blow the thing up. What the fuck? <laughs> blow the thing up that we are trying to steal to make money. Return to Lydia. So this is on the groundsbreaker. Wait. What the fuck? So this is on the groundsbreaker and it's shown on Monarch. Speak with Phineas. This is on the ship and it's shown on Monarch. And retrieve the gunship's targeting module. This is actually on Monarch. This is on Scylla and shown on shown in space. Uh, this is Edgewater by looks of it and shown in space. Uh, don't bite the sun. This is uh, Byzantium and shown in space. And this is Scylla and shown for space. So, yeah, this location region. I mean, it should be like target location, I feel like. Slash region. Target location, that should be it. And it just doesn't work so well. But this is also a little confusing. It's it's not bad. Like you do see the distinction between companion quests. So these these are the main two I use. But I feel like this location. Uh, this is a good tab, but uh, the the missions are just not properly ordered. I did well. Maybe we can leave with this. It's not the best choice. Best choice. So we gotta find the crashed ship, and uh, yeah, we most likely if we find something, we're gonna just give it to Sanja because uh, I don't give it to any crazies. Sure. Oh, it looked like a toilet. I'm like, why does a toilet have a Used to be. bars on it? Get the best wine on Monarch here. I would have liked to see this place before it was all folded up. Oh fuck! Hit up the night. Big mistake. Fireballs! Is this... Yeah, seems to be a little weaker. Why repair your weapons when you can just replace it for another generic assault rifle? Oh, Manti Queen. Where am I? Okay, so we went through. Interior. So we came out the constable office. There is a queen on the bridge. Special enemy. We might as well attack it, I guess. Is it special enemy? Okay. Use some special abilities. I'm getting a little lazy, but let's do it. I have to tell you, but you missed. Oh shit. Can you just go back? Alright. I seem to be struggling here. I'm not sure why. Oh, I, we can just do drugs before the fight. We're better at fighting. And we're gonna single target down one big guy. I didn't 
effect, then he's this strong. Maybe I should just take up the small one. It was over. That's the last of them. Yeah. What a fight. I don't care about their meat. No. Cigarette lighter. Dead Eye Assault Rifle too. That's a kind of interesting. It's level 26. Good DPS. And I, I used to like this assault rifle. It has lower... Lower... Uh... uh DPS, but it's pretty accurate. So maybe I'll try it. I used to like it. Uh, it doesn't have a lot of bullets though. That's gotta be a concern. Shockwave, shock cannon ultra. Okay, it's level 22. Can't go there. I probably should just put it there and um, just play it like that. Mm, that's crap. Adreno! Oh, thanks to legs. Still have to go back and deal with the queen. Cascadia landing pad discovered. Oh, he's attacked me? That's a bad idea. Everyone all right? Oh my god, they lost like 500 HP. Here we go. What? I didn't expect it to survive a shot. Ultra baton! Ultra! Assault rifle. Okay. So, Madrino, it's a little dark in here. I wouldn't mind the flashlight. It's usually not needed, but it would be cool. Oh, the ship is here, but I don't really want to go back yet. I'm a little sleepy and concussed, but I'm not ready to end uh, this journey. Should we go back? It just, it just seems like such a good idea. It would be dumb not to do it. All right. The unreliable exterior. Uh, inferior, uh, interior. Uh, should I replace one of my companions? I don't know. Should we go with Ellie? Uh, Felix. I'm I'm a little lazy to keep uh, switching their their gear. Frankly, I might just go with Ellie again. Parvati stays, that's for sure. Nyoka. Oh, that's my armor. Oh crap, I don't even have a spare armor. <sighs> oh man. Ah, maybe we should just go with Nyoka on this planet. So, you're adjusting before you pull. You're anticipating. It's just kind of silly that uh, Nyoka is teaching Parvati to shoot. Parvati doesn't need any lessons. Okay, let's drink. Eat something. I'm not sure what this is it. That's on account of your stance. Okay, that looks good. 
work with it. Uh, oxy clamp, aromatic. Sure. What? Yeah, that doesn't apply to me anymore. I had a penalty. I was concussed. I just finished the mission. Uh, Nyo can Parvati. It seems good. Yeah, we're always taking Parvati, that's for sure. And I'm not sure about the other companions. Big car max, eh. Oh crap, some vending machines I can even sell. Or maybe buy something that's good. Anything that says good DPS? Look at this, very pricey. But, eh, it's, it's crap. So I'm not buying Ada, it. Is there 63? Don't I have something just like this? It's very similar to what I got. Okay. Leaper injectors. Dodge distance. Okay. I mean, this is not terrible. Really alive, but it. Sorry. But it's. See, can still talk. But I don't need person. more than three. What about Sam? What's it? Sorry. He is he the same thing? Well, Sam's an auto mechanical thing, not a computer brain thing like Ada. I don't think Sam understands gender, so you can call him it if you want. Right, but she's a machine, he's a machine. How are they different? You know how I said Ada was special? Her wiring's a whole lot more complex than Sam's, so she can simulate a personality better than he can. She got more tools in her box, so to speak. Hmm. So he's following his own rules, making everything obnoxiously clean because he has to. Maybe I ought to let bribes. up on him a bit. Oh, uh, we can just trash that. It's not really worth it, but why not? Shh. I'm sorry for killing your children. Mad about it. Oh my god. Look we'll at the damage. Sure. Sorry, can't do that. Oh my god, Parvati died. The fuck? When was the last time I saved? Uh last well Okay fine, this is decent. Oh this is okay, this is a quick save. We have to go with the auto save. Before I left the ship. That's a better save. My last quick save was uh, pretty far away. But the auto save when I left the ship actually is better. So, three shots to kill the a super heavily armored companion. And not like you can uh, control your companions significantly. Not dead yet? Don't mess with like us. Dead. Okay. Okay. All the losers are dead. Soul Rifle Ultra. Sure. Uh, so what's going on here? Thing. I also wanted to go back, take out a queen. It, it does show that... Uh, 
It's hard to be very too careful in this game. Even with all the preparation, like face rolling, kind of, or almost, well, not really face rolling, but like easily dealing with most encounters, we can just run into one lizard that free shots my companion. And that projectile is not hard to dodge, but my companion makes no effort to dodge it, of course. A report written by Rizzo Wildlife Specialist regarding the Project Pitero. It lists concerns that the higher than average volume of Pitero Ray corpses may be attracting local wildlife, combined with the luring purpleberry aroma coming from the Cascadia bottling plant. The engineer worries that the uh, raptors may be encroaching ever closer to the walls. Though the walls are theoretically sound, uh, the engineer warns that they are relatively shallow and that particularly clever raptodons could possibly dig beneath them or find their way into the chemical waste pipes. Yeah. Shallow also means that it's easy to knock over. by bigger uh, beasts, which happen. Also, this is next to uh, a rock, so, I mean, they don't need to be super clever to jump in there. But this is a pretty bad place. If they are not capable of jumping over the fence in the first place, which is not as impressive as it might, might seem. Like, like, dogs can jump so high, well, people have no idea, or at least some people have no idea, like, the dogs can jump like few meters that I've, I've seen. Like, you would not believe if you have not seen it, but it's just crazy. Why do humans suck at jumping? <laughs> no, not really. Taking your stuff. <laughs> Nothing on the balcony. So, seems like that's it. big explosion that we suffered. Making all these wildlife capable of like super accurate spit from and basically making them have guns. Uh, which is kind of dumb. Actually, the wildlife has ever better ranged uh, capabilities uh, than the bandits. Because these guns are like pew 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 and you hide. But the wildlife just sh shoots you with a basically like a super powerful grenade launcher. Something stinks about these evac prep procedures. I know the Prateros were expensive, but shipping them out of here isn't going to be easy. Even the hunters are recommending we let them loose outside the gates. I don't get why they are taking them with us. I, why we are taking them with us anyway. Someone's of the chain must really believe in the project. Ah, uh, okay. We're fucked. <laughs> Shuttle landed on the pad. We started moving potato cages. Some of them broke. Birds everywhere. Talons everywhere. Even the clip ones. Turns out they can run. Who knew? Then the raps got him. I don't know how. Must be a hole in the wall somewhere. Maybe they can dig. Fuck. Uh, they, they, they are all over the, the Pateros at first. And then us. Sumner and the other upper management were already on the shuttle. Rabs got near the pad. Someone panicked. They left us. Wow. 
I got a few home uh, stabilized, but it isn't going to last. Reps everywhere. They cut scent of what's in the bottling plant, and now they are nesting. We need to move. Going uh, to have uh, to book it south across the bridge, cordon off half the town. I've been trying to hail corporate, but uh, none of my messages are getting through. I don't think help's coming. Cecile insists corporate wouldn't abandon us, but I saw that shuttle. There wasn't enough room for us and the birds. Someone up uh, there made a decision and it wasn't for our well-being. Rotten bastards. I make it out of this mess. I'm coming for them. Yeah, that's not how it works. I guess this is what Edgewater is going to look like in a couple of years. Hey, Mantic Queen, Mantic Queens. The corporation takes a dump and walks off without cleaning it up. Oh, shit. Run for a skill. This is not too dangerous. Just gotta kill one Mantic Queen at least. Dead. You guys just run back a little bit. Try to. Oh shit, they're almost dead. What's with these bugs? Fuck me. Every single time. No. We, we only have one way to beat these, and we always have to do that. I'm going. Well, we don't always have to do that, but we have to do that when it's hard. We just camp. Uh, it would be preferable to camp, where we can actually eventually take cover. And this is not too bad. I can take cover over there. What? I managed to blind it? Okay. Yeah, I'm just going. Don't mess with us. Ah, oh, would you look at that? I'm moving. Or... You sure we ought to go this way, Captain? Um. Actually, I I totally. I'm still wrong. But do I even want to go back? Yeah, yeah, we we're going that way. But what? But I wanted to check out. Oh no, there's. Okay. Can we go in? Even like this, I, I just, just miss places. I tried to be as thorough as possible, but I guess I can only try. Workbench discovered, but I don't want to use it. What we got seems like nothing. Forty six. Bah. Nothing. Uh, leather armor. Sure. Break it down. That's it. I don't need to use the workbench. What about this? Hard lock to pick. Can I pick that? Let's see what I'm wearing. 
I am varying the total lock picking. <laughs> uh, here. And uh, I can up my lock picking by upping body and mind. Let's try it. Body. This boosts my lock picking to 94. It's not good enough. What if I go mind? I might 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 do it. I think we might be short. Yeah, we're short. What if I drink another one? Is it possible to stack body? Body again? No. We can only boost we can only get one boost. Oh man, it's so close. What could I do? Uh, because of how skills work in this game, uh, the first skill up is three, then four, then five, and I think the last one is a five. I'm pretty sure that the last one is a five. So for example, I up my long guns now. And I know that doesn't have any bonuses. And I'm... It's either went up by five or six. It actually went up by eight. No, no. It, it went up by five. Uh, because of the... In, because of intelligence. And it went up uh, by three. Because of something else. I'm not sure what else boosts long guns. Oh, because of perception. Yeah. So, 3 and 5. But it goes 3, 4, 5, 5. And just something to keep in mind. When you, you can't go... This, this is fine. I don't know. Oh, man. I don't think we can do it. I don't I don't I can't reach that that high. We got lock picking. This is this counts as double and this counts as double as well. And even even like that, it's not good enough. We we can check. Uh, lock picking. Yeah, 20 plus 31 from Pravati, uh free from the drinks. And we are free short. This sucks. There's, there's no drugs. There are no drugs that would help me. I am super sure. Right? Yeah. The booze. Booze is a trickier one. Uh, I mean, uh, personality is a trickier one to, to boost. But there are no drugs that would work for us here. No, nah. that's it. We can't reach uh, up to 100 lockpick without uh, another companion, without Felix also giving us lockpicking. Okay. That mean you bastards. That means I might uh, consider boosting my lockpicking. The thing is, what we need what I what I should keep in mind is that this might not stay this way because the companions uh gain their skills. Oh shit. No, no, no. Parvati's lockpicking is reduced by her armor. But if Parvati had an armor that gave her lockpicking and didn't have an armor that reduced her lockpicking, then she would have... Maybe that didn't update. What's what's wrong? Her lockpicking is... is reduced for some reason. Do I see that? No, my lockpicking is 102. Shit, we gotta go in. Real fast. 
We got enough. Great work. Woo. I need 100 lock picking for this too. Nicely done. Okay. So, okay. That that worked. Uh no, nah, you're not using that. You're using the one that doesn't give dialogue skills. And you're using a helmet that actually protects you. This is just uh, extra. And wow! So I could use extra skills. And the, how it works is that the companions give you uh, one fourth uh, by, by, by default their, their skills as bonus. But if you go for the inspirational uh, base skill unlock base skill, extra perk, whatever, then they give a plus 100%, so they give you half instead of one one quarter. And that way she gives me a lot more. And I can also enhance her skills, enhance her lockpicking, just like I'm enhancing my lockpicking. Of course, if I give her 10 points of lockpicking, then I'm only gonna get 5, but of course, that still helps. Just to super min max it. Standard troop helmet. Tech shotgun that's garbage. Purple berry police armor. Stealth skills. Why? It's garbage. Okay. So, this is just this was just a treasure room that we needed 100 lockpick for. If I was playing a uh, solo, it would be a lot harder. No shame in taking it. Actually, this is becoming a longer episode. Maybe I should uh, put in a cliffhanger before we find this big ship and decide what to do with it. So, thanks for watching, guys, and see you next time.